been thinking about me, chum. Yeah. I was looking for the bathroom. That one's in use, in a manner of speaking. But if you're looking for something more available, you just got a fresh new batch. Still short on scratch? Yeah. Well, then the least yeah. you could do is give me back that photo you swiped the night I first met you at El Caspar. I think you got me confused with somebody else. Don't kid it, kid her, Jack. I know what you're up to. Mo Persky described you to a T. Trying to cut out the middleman, right, Jack? <laughs> well, let me give it to you straight. Mo Persky don't pimp for those girls. He just gives me their phone numbers. And you tell them you're gonna put them in pictures. They are already in pictures, Jack. I put them in business. Well, I got something else. Something you like better. I once had a dog, Jack. Cute little mud I found in an alley. Took her home, washed her fur, and I named her Kiki. One day, we went out for a walk, and we passed an alley filled with garbage and sewage and fish three days old. That was the end of little Kiki. She finally smelled her way home. That's a good story, Ray. Yeah. What's the deal, chum? You want to have to come ish? Consider it a gift. I've become a father. Do me a favor, will you? Mingle like a good little hostess. It's your honor. In your honor, baby. What is wrong with you? This thing about my past. It's fascinating how intense you become on making a fool out of me in front of absolutely everyone I know on the same night. What is this? A contest? How fast can we make a sucker out of Mickey? Trying to break Diane's record? Mickey. Up hanging. Too much tinsel ruins a tree. I know about Mr. Jalky, but where he is is not one of them. I do know something he doesn't know, though. And it'd be a shame if he found out. What are you after? Ever been fly fishing, Pat? <laughs> Some out, out. <laughs> Where's Pat? Where's Pat? Where is Pat? <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Don't scratch my carpet. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Book here or something? No. I'm not sure of anything. You. I want to 
want us to have a drink before the sun rises like all times, huh? Even when you're trying to be sincere, you sound like a goddamn liar. <laughs> <laughs> in your fucking book. Hey, slow down, chum. Not every girl who poses winds up working. <clears throat> but I have not met more than three in the last 10 years who have rejected the idea. truth since the minute I met her. You weren't gonna tell me. What? Have you gone nuts again like with Diane? We all know the whole crowd knows. But what could we what could we say? There you were, waltzing around town with moonbeam eyes like Andy Hardy with spring fever. Where is she? Huh? Where is she? Hey, she in there? Don't be a chum. What's inside the box, Mickey? Poor little playboy who everybody steps on, or the little man who takes care of business? She in there, right? Because once it's business, Mickey, you're protected here. You know no more be, mousing right? around with women who want you for your money. Just Not without play. them working for she it. She in there, right? Telling me the junkie's name is nowhere in this book? He's not a custom. Then he's a pimp. Well, not as far as I can tell. Look, there are over 500 names in this book. Yeah, and not one of them is junkies. The son of a bitch hangs around with pimps and whores. He doesn't do any business with them. I, I guess he likes the atmosphere. Well, what is he? An aspiring novelist? Look, Davioni's got a string of girls. Erica Steele's got a string of girls. Why don't we go after them? Because I promised Frank Hogan that he'd have a scandal that he could really chew up in an election year. And an out-of-work showgirl and a two-bit press agent are not the stuff exposés are made of. I thought you had Jokey supplying Davioni. Oh, didn't you, huh? It didn't go anywhere. No hard evidence. Why don't we go after the Johns instead? Look, we got phone calls, recordings, actors, celebrities, big-time politicians. I suppose if they were cops, you'd want to arrest them, too, huh? I'm sorry, Mr. Jelpy. There seems to be a freeze on your trust account. This note arrived yesterday. It's co-signed by Mr. and Mrs. Jelpy of Fairfield, Connecticut. Well, what do you expect me to do, Mother? Sell everything and come home like the prodigal son? This is about Pat, isn't it? You don't like her, so you think by cutting me off, I'm, 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 I'm gonna get rid of her. Is that what you think? Is that what you think, Mother? Hold on, Mother, just hold on. You think that I don't know that, Mother? What did you think I was gonna do? Did you think I was gonna marry her? Is that what you think? 
I'm not responsible. I'm stupid. Well, I'm not stupid, mother. I'm not stupid. I'm not stupid. I'm not I'll do what I want to do. you want? With our love to keep us warm? Hmm? Because it sounds like an afternoon radio play. Which I think is way below your standard of invention. Mickey. Pat. Thank you. 